Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien at TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. The TGIF, folks, let's make it a great one. I hope you get some great weather wherever we are out here today because I'm telling you, man, right where we are, it's amazing out here. We got a cold front that came in, and a cold front for us. Just suck the humidity out of the air, folks. It's like 78 degrees out. It's amazing. To master love, you have to practice love. The art of relationship is a whole mastery, and the only way to reach mastery is with practice. To master a relationship is therefore about action, not about attaining knowledge. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials right now trading up 38. NASDAQ is down 78. S&P is up 5. Gold contract down $10.10 10 at 1952 an ounce. You get silver off 34 cents, $25.58 an ounce. Light sweet crude. Where are you, baby? Uh, there you are. There you are. A, a buck. Uh, trading 113.42 notes and bonds they are getting absolutely smoked you get the 10 year right now trading down a full point plus 12 ticks at 121.17 the 30 year off two points plus 11 ticks at 147 flat and king dollar king dollar right now trading up 19 ticks 98.808 our phone number is 877-927-6648 give us a call folks Want to know what's going on in your world? In the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at them. What do you have? Well, bottom line, you get a market. My take, you get a market that wants higher price, number one. We're not going to have an ABC because what you have out here, the B point out here is uh, 450, 58. You need 74 million shares. Hey, I, well, we might. I don't think we're going to do it. We're at 52 million. If you get 74 million, guess what? The bottom line is that that's saying we're going to all-time highs. This market wants higher price. That's the bottom line, folks. We get into the uh, end of the X100. We take a look at the three Qs. What do you have with the three Qs? Three Qs are going sideways. The three Qs are going to have a chance, even on Monday or Tuesday, to basically get that volume in. They need, the volume for an ABC up on the three Qs uh, is uh, 63 million. We're at 45 right now. Uh, yesterday we did 53. So we are going to have more volume there. So we'll see where that baby uh, takes us. Gold. Gold contract here continues to basically build cars for higher price. You're, you're backing down today. Let me see this. Okay, so we're backing down with uh, backing down with 10, 10 bucks. You get 59,000 contracts traded. That's light contract volume on the way down. Bottom line, it, it, this thing wants to make a run, and that's on the short term. On a longer term basis, folks, you get an ABC structure up. That we're talking about a 2,500 to 2,600 gold price. King dollar. Let's go take a look at King dollar out here. We take a look at King dollar. King dollar. Got up to a high today of 98,834. So we didn't have much movement inside of King Dollar out here today. Um, you know, bottom line, it rejected lower price at 98,400. So, you know, this is like a toss up, man. But it looks to me like, once again, you know, okay, uh, look, just look at this. This is really cool, okay? You talk about, you know, uh, a nice triangle, man. I mean, this is pretty intense how this shakes out. Now, normally what happens with something like this, too, by the way, is that whatever way we break out of this, you want to be really careful because the way these, you, you can see we're coming to the very end of it. Most of the time, you normally get a false break and the thing goes the other way. So it's going to be intriguing watching this shake out as to where it's going to go. Let's go take a look at rig Transocean. And, you know, by the way, folks, okay, so picture it. You have the S&P as well as the NDX 100, they're trying to do ABC structures up. They don't have the volume. That being said, and I've seen this replay before, okay, these oil stocks want to run in an incredible way. If that's what happens, you will go, you're going to continue to see a higher market. It's just, it's just a change of acceleration, a change of strength inside sectors that bring it higher. We take a look at rig, uh, bottom line, what you have out here, the low for the year is 263, the high is 556, and we put this on a monthly, what you're going to see is that this is not only, you know, bottom line, it's finally sticking its head up, you can see the volume, the volume is huge, man, the volume on the monthly right now is uh, 742 million, so, let's see, price-wise, you're over that, you're over the three, you're over... Uh, Okay, you're not, you're not, it's on, it's on the way to seven. Let me get this closer. Okay, so I'll put it in five years. 
Yeah, there we, oh, it's an ABC up. Oh, this is even better. Okay, let's do this. Look at this, baby. Thanks, Fletch. This is a beauty, man. Okay, so you get 513. Oh, man, it's a, you get a four, what's that, 65? 513, 65, 450, 550, seven bucks. It's, an, it's a confirmed ABC up. Yeah, you get a confirmed, well, did we hit? 556. Yeah, let's confirm the ABC up. You got big get action here, man. This thing wants higher price. That's how, that's how this thing is uh, laid out right now. I go take a look at Twitter, TWTR. I better be right on this one because the tiger's telling me his wife wants to buy it. <laughs> he's, he's worried. I don't blame, blame him to be worried. You ne what, what happens, folks, is that you never want to be buying stocks to someone else. I can tell you that. I mean, yeah, I'm in the newsletter business, and I, it, it's tough, okay? But the bottom line is that... Uh, family, yeah, I think you should stay away from that. But hey, let's do Twitter, because my, my take, Twitter's a buy also. And what's really cool about this, so when you take a look at Twitter, Twitter's trading $38.35. and The low fee is 31 the high 73 The bottom line, we take a look at this, what you're gonna see is that you have the first leg that's up. I'm gonna put this on a weekly, because it's a little bit clearer on the weekly, that bottom line, when you get wide price spread, accelerated volume which we got last week that broke the downtrend and it's a heck of a downtrend that it broke i mean when you take a look at this you would just br you would bring this the most conservative way is that you bring it from 68 bucks so it just depends on how long you want to hold it you know the first the first move on this should bring this up to somewhere about 43 and right now you're at 38. the uh the pot stocks are on the move i mean if you've been waiting for pot stocks folks don't wait too much longer um, these babies, you just had canopy growth. That just finished an ABC structure in the way up. You know, it's off the lows of uh, 562. You're running out here at uh, 854. If we take a look at this and you put this on a weekly basis, the bottom line, you're going to see the same type of setup. You know, I suspect we'll see how this shakes out, but it looks like to me canopy is going to run to 1143. And they're all running. And it would make sense, too, because guess what? They've totally got smoke. You stay right there, folks. So we have the Dow Industrials right now trading uh, up 52. NASDAQ is down 64. S&P's up 9.5. Coming back with my man, Mr. Bestman B. Hewley. We're going to be talking real estate, baby. Stay right there.